us? Well, what do you think? Seems to me that there's a lot of you out there who might need the use of the law of counting. But that's not legal advice. That's life advice. In fact, we're legally barred from providing legal advice. The law of counting. Officially unlicensed since 2005. Okay. At the Good. Forest Foundation, we care about three things. Tree Good. things, nature things, and the third thing, bird things. The These I like. Native birds are being destroyed These I have a lot of time for. Okay. That's why our These are my favorite ones. Bird to every bird on Earth. Okay, so it goes that way. Then we have to have one that comes around like this and connects up. Go another way. Dirty birdie to 30 30. You can either be part of the problem or you can be with us. The Forest Foundation. Dirty, dirty birdie to dirty to 30 30 birdie. The best music from around the globe. This has to go up like that. We can maybe do it like this. Look. We might get away with this, you know. Thanks to Road Anarchy. There's like a little bit of room there, right? There's a little tiny bit of room. I think it should be fine. Oh, there's pl <laughs> uh, There are some cars floating in the air. It's true. That much is true. Do 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 do. Is there enough room for them to get through there? I'm thinking, yeah. Easy. And there's definitely enough room for them to get in there. You can't see the signs, though. You can That's the only thing. People may get confused. Hey, why, you big bitch? Why what now? What happened? What happens? Why now what? What's happening? That's a bit more gradual now, isn't it? And that means that we can make it even more gradual by doing that. Okay, good. All right, I'm pretty happy with that connection. Um, I'm, I'm happy enough with Walur's hole as it is, I think. Um, there's a, there's a, there's definitely a way for people to get into the city through, we're seeing Spaghetti Western now. Um. I won't be able to sleep tonight unless I do this. Okay. I'm very particular about my pipes. So just bear with me, okay? Sorry, guys. Sorry, but trust me, it'll be worth it in the end, I promise. That pipe coverage is no good. What? <laughs> What's wrong? What? It's, it's not easy replanning an entire section of your city, okay? I'm doing my best here. I'm just trying to do my best. I'm just enjoying the Where's game the, the way I like to enjoy it. After me. You can have a fast food place, no problem. Thanks, Tent Fatties, for the uh, donations. I appreciate it, man. What do you want, like a donut store or something? A toilet store. Gotcha. Let's see if we can find a toilet factory for Tent Fatties.
You guys, will, you guys are gonna thank me later when this pipe work is like a masterpiece. It's gonna be my Mona Lisa. This is gonna be my, my own personal Mona Lisa. When it's done, and it's flowing perfectly, you just thank the big guy over here, okay? And when I say big, I mean like big. I put on a lot of weight since becoming a dad. It's true. You know, I used to tell people that it's all muscle mass, but... And, you know, to some extent that's true. I am a muscular guy. But I also love cake. <laughs> I love eating cakes. Just so woke up, that, saw too. you were streaming Day Brightened. I love you, Dad. Question, oh. can I have a dog park named after me? Yes. Keep it up, Sips. Yes, you certainly can. You most certainly can, my friend. A dog park is yours. Okay. Now, hang on one second here, though. That's never going to work, is it? It's not going to get that the coverage that we need in the place that we need. Fuck, I thought we were up for another another round of Viking gods. God damn. Okay. That's better. Wait. I just put it right back where it, where it was before, right? Cuz I'm dumb. Apologies. Apologies. I had a bit of a moment there. I had a little tiny bit of a moment. I like to place my pipes realistically under the roads, okay? Is that a crime? Is that a crime? I don't think it is. I like to imagine the, the work crews digging up the roads for the pipes and stuff. That's why I put them under there. Same with the electrics. Underground electrics. Colossal order, come on. Let's let's make it a reality. The next expansion pack. Underground electrics. That'll just be the whole expansion. Ever wanted electrics under the ground? Now you can. 33.99. Are there any other features in that expansion? No. Nope. And you know what? There doesn't need to be either. Under underground power lines. That's the theme. Oh, that pipe's going right through Walur's hole. That pipe is going really deep inside of Walur's hole. All right, Central Park is all hooked up. That's good. Sips. Look at that, guys. Consider adding four lane roads with turning lanes to slow at least traffic. Also, can you name the new spaghetti above Teagles after me? Um, Much love, 20. The new spaghetti above Teagles after you. Hang on. It depends who you are, okay? Do you have a suitable name, Patty Cake? You know what? You do. You do. Old, old patty cake. <laughs> nice. I like that. All right, we have to find like a, a factory that makes stuff for 10 fatties as well. Let's, let's try to find a suitable factory for 10 fatties. High tech gadgets, eco-friendly. Bruce Enterprises, the recycling center. 
Aero Designs, Fine Fashions. Frank's Gourmet Fish Stick Factory. Here we go, look. Okay, look. Ten fatty. Gourmet fish stick facto. Okay, there you go, ten fatties. You got it, baby. It's all yours. Oh, I think Slough looks way better now. I think it looks way, 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 way better. I'm almost tempted to upgrade this road running down here too, but... I don't know if we can now that... Well, you know what? We could do it. It would just mean pushing this back a bit. It would be fine. Okay. What did we go for here? We went for little four-lane roads, right? We did, yeah. Okay, perfect. They're like the small four-lane roads. It was these ones here. Okay, we're almost ready to start plopping again. We're almost ready to go full plop. So the idea then is to expand out this way, following the grid, and then we have the grid go up like this too, and then we have to like fill in this space. But see, we can square off this space here easily, square it off going up this way, have the road run next to it, have it go up this way, and then we'll just have like sort of a triangular shape take, take shape here as well after a while. Alright, so are we like mostly hooked up here? It looks like we are. Okay, another thing that we Hello. want to do inside Slough. Could I get Slough. a piece of land named after me to add to my estate? Yours sincerely, Sir Harold Esquire. Okay, we want to... 50% uh, less workers, 30% more electricity and generates... Okay, yeah, we want IT clusters in here for sure. So this is going to be like... Um, mostly... I think that this is mostly going to just be IT clusters and commercial, right? But we'll try to like make it so that... Okay, check it out. First off. First things first, man. We go like this. Okay. We go IT clusters. Like that. We're gonna try to, like, separate it out. So, like, we'd have, like, industry here. And then a big whopper of commercial here. And then maybe, like, more industry over here. Gotta have that top spot if it is only for a day, but sips don't forget my dog park. Your dog park? Oh yeah, we have to add some parks, so you got it, baby. I'll add you. I got you. I'm all over it. We're gonna have to hook up some power in here, too. new apparel. Per new. Italian leather. Italian threading. Not per new. Is Italian for a jean jacket. Oh. We take the second best of Milan and with an appropriate markup, bring it to you. Per new. Just because you don't have taste. All right. So hang on. Where do we have to hook some power up? We're gonna have to run some power. Clothes, but not cross the highway here. I think will be the best place to do it. All right. Let's start building stuff because we're losing some money now. That emo chick, thanks so much for the donation, and Sir Harold Esquire, thanks for the bits as well. Hi, I'm Greg, owner and founder of Steel Frame Spots. Due to unusually short fingers, which are a characteristic of my family line, oh, I baby. was unable to play it's spots happening. at the elite level it's I happening. would have liked to. Instead, Wait. I invested my energy into Ted is no longer hooked the up. Price as possible on athletic gear. Unlike the level spot Let's hook teams, up Ted. You can count on us every year. Good job, Ted. Every day to get you the best deals. I'll never drop the ball on prices 
and that's because low prices and my customers oh you know what i didn't even hook up all of slough short fingers mentioned hang on a second in the advertisement just remember let's hope that this pipe line, never bursts May your pipe Fox. never burst. That, it's being protected by teagles. <laughs> Alright, so this is going to be all clustery, IT clustery stuff, which means that this area of downtown, especially surrounding teagles, is going to be... It's going to be amazing. I almost spilled my water as well. One pipe is all I need. We'll get it to you fast with a smile and completely without judgment. So, Meaty bits. Good enough for Tony Magoni's steakhouse. Why not be good enough for Joe Public's home house? Mm. Okay, get and then we go. Bits. Tell him Tony sent you. Meaty bits. Give oh, you know what? Actually, I think we want the commercial to be more like up here, right? Hey, listeners, you're tuned into Cities Radio. We've got the best music from anywhere. We'll have a big area of commercial here. And you know what? We're going to have some apartments in here too. We're going to we're going to get some apartments in here. So, where we have we're going to have um self-sufficient buildings. Yes. Okay. Slow is going to be like a model for the future. It's gonna be incredible, guys. It's gonna be incredible. Okay. The supermarket needs to be moved. Oh, shit, we don't have a space big enough for the supermarket. Okay, let's shove it in here. Okay, perfect. Let's get the ma'am in here somewhere too. Let's shove the ma'am there. We got this stadium as well. It can go right next to the ma'am. That's gonna be a busy area of town. We got the television station as well. Perfect. We've got um, the Ausif Salim Memorial Hospital, which we kept intact. We also have the lungs of the city, which is too big. So we're going to put it right next to here. Right next to the shopping mall. Who wants the lungs of the city? We're going to call this one the... Um, El, El, Alexios of the city. There you go. Alexios. You can have that one, okay? For having a high amount of doubt in my abilities to make a grid. Ah, this is a gym. I think we need to put a, a gym near the Ikea. It's a sports hall and gymnasium. You could drop your kids off there when you're going to do some shopping at Ikea. Okay, here's a big fire station. A, ton a Tony Nagoni's fire station. Okay, let's also get a big police station in here. wait for the demand to like change a little bit we're gonna need something soon right you miss electricity nice me too I miss it big time we might have to just run some electricity like this just for now to try to kickstart the demands of the city. We're gonna try to kickstart the demands of the city and see how the traffic flows up here too. So it looks like 
the industrial traffic is favoring this route. So this is all of the external industrial traffic coming from this side, no longer going through the middle of the city. So it's going all along the outside and then hooking up to here. That's pretty good. I like that. And then it's going through the spaghetti with chicken to get in here and kind of joining on with some of the traffic from Ted as well to get over here. That's pretty good, no? No? A brand new neighborhood, but nobody wants to come in? Ah, it's, all, it's always the way with a brand new neighborhood. Look, the demand will just like fulfill itself and it'll be it'll get there it'll just build slowly over time now the city just needs to run for a bit now to write itself and then it'll be good it'll be fine I think that I think that this is much better I think that this this is much better than what we had it's gonna be much easier to like expand and plan stuff around too right the Millennial District. Can we have some music that isn't Cities Radio? Yeah, we can pretty soon. Full speed. You want full speed? What if my computer's already like spitting fire though? But you don't care. No, no. Mr. Ideas has another idea here, guys. It's a sexy one. It's a sexy idea that requires us not to... Wow. <laughs> oh, my God. That didn't take long, did it? Jeez. Look at this traffic. Look at all these people trying to get into the city here. They're trying to attend... They're, they're trying to access these new premises. I think it's just the initial, like, flood of traffic when new stuff builds. It'll balance out after, don't worry. It'll be fine. This, uh, this infrastructure is red hot. It's no problem. Is that slightly, like... Oh, it's fine, isn't it? It just looks weird from up here. Maybe it's fine, I don't know. It's, uh, you think it's because they're all moving in? Definitely worry? Nah, come on. It'll be fun. They're just moving in. This traffic is not moving at all. They all want to come down here so that they can get into this new commercial area. And then look, whilst you're chilling in the city, you can watch all of this cool industrial traffic weave its way into the city. It's going to be incredible. It's going to be incredible. This, I think I think replanting Slough has crippled the city. <laughs> like, none of the industry is working now. None of the industry is working. And we have some problems with crime as well. Okay, let's fix these crime problems. And we'll get this fire coverage as well. We just need the demands to start, like, evening out now. Oh yeah, public transport will cut down on a lot of this too. We haven't even put in the public transport yet. We'll put in the public transport. Ah, look, see, stuff's building now. It's starting to build. It's starting to build. Okay. Mr. Ideas has a pretty good, good idea though. Are you ready for this? Check out this great idea that Mr. Ideas had. Ah. Yeah. And... Check out this other fantastic idea that Mr. Ideas has. Okay, now you're thinking... Sips, what the fuck, man? What, are you just gonna, like, upgrade these ones, like, next to it? Hell no, Mr. Ideas is not all about that. You know what Mr. Ideas is gonna do? That's right, baby. Oh, look out. Look out. Mr. Ideas is gonna build, build this six-lane road. It's gonna connect up like this. Oh. Oh, <laughs> my... I don't know what happened there. There's just like a little patch of 
patch of grass. Yeah. <laughs> well, that was the idea. I didn't realize it was gonna, like, fuck up so monumentally. That's probably fine, right? That's probably fine. Now we're just gonna have, like, the craziest intersection up here, too. Coming off of Walur's Hole. But look, we can hook up the rotary again. At least, right? <laughs> Whoa! Wow. Okay, that's an interesting... Yo! <laughs> Look at the ramp! Look at the ramp! God, it's still a, it's still a serious ramp, isn't it? Jeez. Rob Hall Rotary has had a bit of a, I'd say a facelift, but it's more of like a facial depression. It's had a facial depression. Okay, uh, once we get the public transport in, I think this will be fine. We'll get rid of a lot of the commuter traffic, right? Ninety degree road road grade tools. I think we were using those. Oh, you mean these ones, the grade, the 90 degree road grades, yeah. I mean, that's nothing. Look at this one. Woo! <laughs> wow! Woo! <laughs> that's incredible, look. Wow, this is actually being used quite a bit now. We went from it not being used at all to all of a sudden seeing some traffic. It's pretty good. How's the Spaghetti Western doing? Good, it's flowing. It's getting a little bit bit busy over hey, here. Hey Sips, That's I'd okay. like you to know you helped me through some real tough times. Aww. When I was four months old, my great Gan Poppy's dog died and you brought me back from the bring and now I can finally say XD again. Thanks, Bilbo for mod. Oh, I'm glad to hear that, man. Sorry to hear about your grandpappy. Sorry to hear about your your grandpapper. That sucks, eh? It sucks when your grandparents get old and then they pass away. We've all been there. I've lost um I've lost three grandparents now at the ripe old age of I'm gonna be 25 next month. I've already lost three grandparents. Nuts, isn't it? It's nuts. Especially if you're close to them. Not a lot of people are close to their grandparents, are they? It's like, some people just don't like the smell of where there's originals and stuff. Which is understandable. Very understandable, isn't it? Okay, let's have a big old district of... We'll let the population grow in here slowly over time as well, right? We're gonna make a big old district of houses in Slough, okay? It's not enough for it to just be commercial and offices. We have to have some people living in here too. And actually, this can be all residential too. Perfect. That's nice. I like that. Look, all these people who are going to live really close to the stadium. The Bon Jovi. Calling it the Bon Jovi. Because why not, right? We're back in the green now, at least. No? Once you turn 25, you're almost dead. Nah, come on. Come on. 25 is the new 15. Right? Am I right when I say that? 
pretty sure I'm right when I say that. All right, let's start getting some, some, some PT in here, shall we? We're gonna get a bit of PT in here. We're gonna hook this up from here. Oh, actually, we wanted to have a, um, we wanted to have a looper in here, didn't we? So let's go for this. It'd have to be this anyway. Tell you what we do. We put a road there, right? So that we can nestle this on the side. Like that. that is perfecto. And we're gonna want one like the over here too. Saurus. For millennia. These gentle I think that's probably about right. The and then we're gonna want one like off the lush vegetation of the time. here too. Their mere existence transformed the landscape and made a lasting impact on our world. It's that legacy that Dino Oil is proud to continue. Dino by using their oil. eons old dead bone goop to fuel your five door dead wagons. Bone goop. Making it the oldest form of recycling there is. Dino oil. Dino goop. Embrace the power of bones. <laughs> Dino goop. Who likes bones? You been more about Raise your hand lately? if you I'm like sure bones. It's just me, but I feel like meteors and sinkholes just didn't happen as much when I was younger. Maybe I just wasn't paying attention. One time the street behind my house just disappeared. It was there one day, then gone the next. The weird thing was, nobody seemed to want to talk about it. Maybe it was too scary. Actually, if things can just disappear randomly, maybe I can disappear. That is scary. I need to play another song. Wow. Fault Tech Games. If you want the best, you've got to go big. That's why our cameras are the biggest on the market. Our shutters the loudest. Our lenses the longest. Cameras aren't paper lights. They're tools. Tools used to create. In fact, the most valuable camera is the one that you're afraid to take outside. Fault Tech. Only the best. You say At Fault Tech? Bank, we want you to trust us with your money. Because it's with your money that we can make you more money. How? It's not funny business. It's money business. You give your money to us and it will grow with interest. Money business. That's the plan at least. Maybe that's too complicated for you. Imagine planting a money tree in the ground and watering it. Imagine if you had a money we want a big old looper. It more money, and after digesting, it would... Um, okay. You want to go money fishing, so you use a little money to catch a big money. You know, just come in and talk to us. We have even more metaphors that allow us to avoid saying what we really do with your money. Van Hammer Bank. Feed the money monster. This is Diddy's Radio. The best music in the universe. Okay. Now we have this other looper in here, too. So we create a line. And the line goes like a little something like this. It goes around. It comes around. It goes around. And it comes around. And then it connects up. Good. And then we get these guys hooked up in here on this little line. It's like magic. And then we have one going the other way too. Just in case you want to go a different way. Because why not? That's fine too. Perfect. And then it comes back. Around in a perfect little looper. Except for, hang on a second, there's a power line in the way. A power line that does not need to be there, I don't think. It did need to be there, it turns out. That's fine. 
We want it like we want a nice station by the stadium, the hospital, and the ma'am. Your ma'am. And then we want it to go onto this main road here too. Okay, we should hopefully cut down on a bit of traffic now. Once some of this is in and the and the lines start running. Okay, we'll listen to this and then I'll change it back to like a jazzy playlist, okay? Tell me that this song won Eurovision. Or at least our kingdom might fall one. I hope you guys have good news for me in that regard. I cast my vote. Did you guys? Did you guys cast your vote? Our kingdom might fall. Yeah, that's the thing. It might. Our kingdom might fall if you don't believe. Our lies will come true if you don't believe. Viking God! Wow. <laughs> I did not expect this much traffic to come in here. It's growing though. We're growing. What our our metro? Oh, no wonder. We're down to ten thousand. We were up at we were up above fourteen thousand at one point, right? Once Slough builds up, it'll be fine. It's a lot of people moving in. It's a lot of people trying to um, to use the new um, mass transit sort of um, stuff. There's a whole bunch of factors affecting the traffic here. Oh, another thing that we should probably do as well, if I haven't done it already. Let's go into um, Traffic Manager, Gameplay, and let's put some dynamic lanes. Let's make like, I don't know, like 30% of people use dynamic, and let's enable more realistic parking as well. And let's save my game as well, just in case it crashes. It's feeling a bit crashy. Okay. A deal is a deal. 
Let's find, let's listen to, oh yeah, here we go, guys, here we go, here we go. Playlists. Oh, yes, this could be the one. That's not good. Oh, this is the one. Bring Hobbit equality. Sorry, at date Xamox chic. What? Bring Hobbit equality. Okay, they, they, like 35% of cars should pick better lanes now, which will make a big difference as well, right? And make a huge diff. It'll make a big old diff. Constant serenity. Cemetery usage is at 100%. You might be right about that. Do, 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 do. do we even have any cemeteries in Belbibdo Heights? I don't think we do. Not a one. Not even one. No. Auto delete buildings and auto move mods are great. Mm. Ricky Lake is, yeah, she's looking dry, isn't she? We're trying to fill her back up, but it's not going well. We may yet have to run a canal through her. We'll just see, though, how it goes. Okay, so Slough is developing. It's a big, it's a big old development happening in Slough after the changes that we made. And it's going to take some time. But uh, we're, we're in the red now. We were making money, and now we're losing a lot of money. Wait, have we lost like a million? I think we've lost a million. Possibly. You guys aren't up for canals? What do you guys have against canals, exactly? What's the problem with canals? You don't like them? I fucking love a canal, me. God, I love canals. I'm very tempted to make more canals, even. Would you guys be up for that? There's still a lot of abandoned buildings in Dirty Canuck Land and Ted, but hopefully it'll all balance out after a while. Let's see what Metro ridership is up to now. It still hasn't gone up much. Oh, you know what we need to do as well? We need to go the other way. Okay. This one is going to be called... How do you spell Mr. Mistopheles? <laughs> I don't know how to. Okay. Let's just call it the Mr. T... M memorial memorial 
Looper. Lion. Okay. The Mr. T Memorial Looper Lion. And it has to be gold. Just like Mr. T. Perfect. Alright. We have the Mr. T Memorial Looper Lion. And then let's also have... Um... The... The, da the, the Dale Kennedy Memorial Looper Badooper. Looper Badoop. Okay, and we'll make this one like a sort of, a sort of gross. Wait, it has to like contrast with the. Make this one blue. Oh, yeah, there you go, Dalek. That's a. There. Nice. How many people are on this? There's a couple of people waiting at the stops. Okay. Let's just make sure that we have... Holy crap. Look at all the people. Look at all the people waiting at this station. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay. There's a lot of people transferring over here. All right, we should be able to slam dunk a lot of people into the city with 14 trains on this line. A solid mass of bodies, yeah. Look, we're loading them all in. We've had to hire full-time student pushers to push people onto the metro lines here. It's so, it's so clogged up. Everybody's trying to get to the Bon Jovi concert at the same time. We're barely making a dent here. Look at this. That train is full, I think, from other stops, maybe. Okay, there's a little bit of room. Push them on, boys. We're paying you the big bucks for your pushing abilities. All right. Let's get a big push here. Oh, good job. Starting to thin out the herd a little bit. All right. Put your pushing gloves on. Big push. Oh, that's what we wanted. That was a real big push. These, these cars are just solidly packed with people. And they're all going to destinations unknown. Loving the metro loops. Oh, How yeah, the... about a cross-city subway express as well? It looks like we've got a whole bunch of people piling up in here now, too. We're going to have to up, the, up the, the cars on this line to eight. There's a couple of people starting to pile up in here, too. It's not too bad yet, though. Uh, what was that? How about a Cross City Subway Express as well? Whoa, Nelly. And Bilbo knows. And Bilbo knows. And, uh, that emo chick. And Sir Harold Esquire. Oh, yeah, I have to name something after you. Don't I, Sir Harold Esquire? You know what? You can have this. You can have... The Sir Harold Esquire map. You got the man, baby. It's all yours. Ma'am in heaven. Alright, so hopefully, hopefully, we cut down a little bit on the traffic that's coming in through Slime's Ball Bag into Walur's Hole and then into Slough. Into Slough proper. We, we try to cut down a little bit on this traffic. There's a lot of traffic queuing up here, too. Look at all this traffic queuing up for miles here. There are lights here, but I think there need to be lights here. Just the light hasn't gone for like a long time. I mean, it's, it's, it's not all clogged up though. Like, you have to expect to get stopped at a light sometimes, right? It's only it's only fair that maybe you'll hit a red light from time to time in the city. This will need to be sorted, though. But it might just sort itself out. I think everything else looks like it's flowing pretty good, though. I think it's fine. It looks like it's evening out a little bit. Uh, 
Have I unlocked any monuments? Yeah, I've unlocked two. We placed them sort of temporarily as well. We got the um, power one, which is down here. And uh, we got the uh, space elevator as well, which is just constantly feeding us tourists who spawn cars straight out of the thing and also go to Pernu International. Pernu International serviced 953 passengers last week. It's pretty good. But Pernu International isn't flying back over to here, is it? It shouldn't. It shouldn't be. It might be, though, in some cases. Look, this traffic at Walur's Hole is not bad right now. It's just the traffic here that's a bit of a problem. We could just delete this road and force them down here instead to, to this intersection. I'll leave this all clear. Before we do the road, though, let's just ban traffic on it. So I don't think we need lights here now, if that's the case. Do, 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 do. And then the lights here should just constantly like shove people in here. It might get like overloaded soon, but we'll just see how it goes. Oh wait, we actually have some commercial demand. Can you believe this? It's nuts. And my whole life with his words killing me softly with his songs. Alright, let's build some commercial buildings. I don't think we need, like, tourist buildings in Slough, right? We could have, like, a little sort of, like, designated block for tourism, though. Ships, could we you could... name something after Jean-Luc Picard, question mark? Like a theater or a space thingy. <laughs> Jean-Luc Picard! Oh, my God. Why is nobody using the rotary? Eh, there's a couple of people using the rotary. It's a legit way to get in. It's a legit hey way Sips, to get into the long city. time lover of your beautiful face. Oh, Got thanks, a rare man. day off just me and my dong, so I thought I'd show my appreciation for all the videos over the years and oh. making me laugh so many times less than three. Thank you so much, man. I appreciate that. Thank you. Okay, check this out, boys. Mr. Ideas coming at you with another fantastic idea. Okay, look. We're gonna do this. We're gonna carve out a little district within Slough. And this is gonna be for tourism. We can even do another one for leisure as well if we want to, which could be fun. Mr. Ideas. Fucking red hot on the ideas today. Okay. actually need to create the district though hey thanks very much cookie bear one and uh miranas thanks very much for those donations we will name this this leisure area the jean-luc picard district there and the jean-luc picard district will of course be for tourism so we should get some nice hotels and stuff in there and that makes sense right you want to have hotels near like some of these some of these nice sites within the city right elementary school we're gonna need some we're gonna want to put them close to where the people live ie in this residential area
I think our education budget is, like, maxed out. Okay, we have capacity now. How about high schools? Okay, we're gonna need a couple. We're gonna need a few high schools, it turns out. <laughs> we're gonna have a couple of high schools just, like, side by side in here. It should increase the, uh, the land value of the area as well. These places should be able to upgrade and stuff. Alright, perfect. And then universities, I think we're... Yeah, we're more than okay with universities. We have plenty. Flute me up inside. Kill this music with... What are we talking about? On Fridays, the schools get together and have a fight to the death. I don't think that that's what happens on a Friday. Schools usually do fun stuff on a Friday. It's like they do a sponsored walk or maybe like they teach you how to walk your dog properly and stuff like that. You really want to limit the amount of killing that happens at a school. Having like a Friday death day is not part of the curriculum. Alright. It just doesn't happen. Not in this town anyway. We value our, our young little whippersnappers. We want to get them edumacated as soon as possible so that they can go out and achieve great things. I.e. planning the next big we're seen spaghetti western. Or maybe even coming up with ingenious ideas like the braid. The braid one and its predecessor the braid two. Which is actually pretty much a carbon copy of the braid one. We got two though. We got two braids. We got a lot of abandoned industrial buildings. This is a huge industrial site. Holy crap. Right next to the airport too. It's really good. I like it. I like that a lot. No? The braid two. The braid name. That's if they survive the traffic to school? Well, I think most of the kids, if they're if they're smart and the education is paid off, will use the metro. I mean, if they're driving in a car into this city, they're pretty dumb. They are pretty dumb. Oh, look at all these hotels going up! Oh, this is great. This is just great. This is just what we wanted. The Jean-Luc Picard district. See, now we have, like, these nice squares that we can make into, like, districts. Like, we can make this into, a like, a gaming district. You can fill it up with leisure activities for the people to enjoy themselves at. Or maybe even have it down here close to the hotels. I'm not sure yet. I haven't quite decided. 